welcome to the third and final part of this little hunt series where I am exploiting this glitch just north of Sanity on some birds, okay? The first two parts, you might want to check those out because this is the conclusion of the series here. During this part, I'm going to make three trips to the butcher in a real time of 19 minutes and 12 seconds. And this finishes off our total hunt, which goes a duration of 50 minutes and 46 seconds. During this 19 minute period, I pick up almost $55, earn almost 480 XP, which brings our totals in for the entire 50 minute and 46 second hunt, $132.67 and 1148 XP, which translates to $156.80 per hour along with 1,357 XP per hour. It was a real-time earnings. You know, the video here is legit backup. This isn't speculation. This is actually documented earnings in-game. During this particular three-trip, 19-minute period, I'm earning $171 per hour over that 19 minute period so you can see you know like there is potential to even make two hundred dollars an hour if you come in and you get really lucky you know you spawn in and there's a flock of pelicans and a flock of heron flying overhead and you gun down enough to fill up on both and you look down there's a couple of alligators you take and kill two alligators fill up on big okay, game meat too one of the alligators okay. is a perfect pelt you throw that on the horse. You're coming in here getting paid. I don't know. Maybe the cap is even going to be somewhere at like 250 300 bucks. I don't even know what you could get per hour cap-wise. I would have to run this hunt, I don't know, probably like another 50 times before I felt real comfortable putting the cap on this. I mean, obviously, it's probably not going to like get over $300 an hour because that would be almost double what I'm getting here. But I could see easily over $200 an hour, two and a quarter on rare occasion. And, I mean, look at my cores. My my health, my dead eye core, they're almost completely full. They stay almost completely full during this entire 50-minute period. I don't have to eat any food. My guns stay cleaned. At the end of the hunt, when I'm running back in on the, very la on the way to the butcher on the very last run, I show in my item wheel my varmint rifle condition is still maximum condition because I cleaned it before I started this hunt. But because I'm closing the application at the butcher each time, it's wiping away the fact that it got dirty. The server's not saving that information. And every time I load back in, I have a clean gun, I have full cores, and I'm ready to go. Now something that you should definitely know and be aware of is... Your awards, your progress on your awards will get reset when you close the application. So if you're trying to rank up your awards, then this might not be something you want to do. But you can exploit that too. So let's say you use the award to sell items to a butcher. And you go to the butcher and you're 10 items away from selling 500 items to a butcher. So then you sell those 10 items and you get the award for the XP. And then you close the application and you come back up here and you kill some more animals and you go back down you sell 10 more items to the butcher. You get the XP for that 500 point reward again. You know, like you can keep rolling over that award unless they've changed it. Okay, there it's a possibility that Rockstar's fixed that. So I guess don't quote me on it because I haven't actually tested that in a long time. You know, back when I was, like, maybe level 60 or level 70, then, you know, I could actually still do that award. Then sometimes I might notice, you know, awards resetting on me and stuff. Like, that was a thing back then. And I'm kind of assuming it's still a thing now. Because if your awards are resetting, then you can just keep banking the XP on them. That's how it works. Until they fix it, and I haven't heard them fixing it, then I'm just going to keep saying that's what happens, because I'm pretty sure it is. If... If I'm wrong, let me know down below in a comment, because I, I don't want to be steering people wrong. So definitely check the comments down below 
to make sure that there's not any updates to this method or other things that you should know because I might not be remembering to mention everything. I'm only human. I'm just trying to help inform you and let you understand these game mechanics a little better. Show you some methods to make money. You know, I'm not saying this is the best method either. I'm just giving you an option, trying to show you some ways to do things, and then you can take that knowledge and go figure out your own method. Figure out what's fun for you. So now after I sell it to the butcher, I'm going to head to the post office. I'm going to fill up on ammunition because I'm running low. And then I'm just going to close the application again. And next time I jump back in game, I'll be right back at it again. And I'll catch you next time. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Until next time, happy hunting and happy trails.